This time we open a real Greek phyllo pastry. And by the way, it's a special one because I'm in Greece at my mother's place. So follow me in her kitchen, not in my kitchen, in her kitchen to see how easy it is and how tasty to make your own phyllo pastry dough. Cooking tricks and tips from the kitchen of Nikos. And now she will make the dough because she makes dough from before and she keeps it in the freezer. And when she needs it, she's just defrosting the dough and she makes the pitas with all kinds of fillings. So now, my mother's name actually is Angeliki or we call her Angela. Look at the name of my mother. Look at the name of my Αγγελική. Λοιπόν, τώρα θα αρχίσουμε τη ζύμη. Okay, now we start the dough. Μετράμε αυτό το φριτζάνι για δύο πίτες. Ναι. Εφτά ποτήρια. So for seven cups. Δύο. Τρία. Τρί. Τέσσερα. Φορ. Πέντε. Φάιβ. Six. Six. Seven. 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 She continues. So she puts uh, sunflower oil. To my surprise, I thought she always put olive oil. She said olive oil makes the dough too hard. Okay, so one cup of sunflower oil. Okay. Orea. Oh yeah, some vinegar. So three small spoons of vinegar. This is the dose. Okay. Some salt. Okay, just, just a little bit. For Greeks, a little bit. It's for you, probably, guys, a bit too much. Anyway, a little bit of salt. Hey, Pavlos? He's laughing. Okay, now we'll put some uh, water. Poso nero thavalume? Ah, we don't have quantity of water. We put some water as much as it takes, he says. So this is one cup. Two cups. Okay. And then we see, she says, if he needs more, we put more. So she continues until it's ready and not sticking in our hands of fingers. Exactly. Some flour, of course, it doesn't, doesn't get sticked. And we work. What's your other lives to Zimari, Mama? So he doesn't have really a time how long you should work with the dough. You feel it, she says to me. If it's soft enough, then it's enough. So now she's pressing like this the dough she made already. Now we open it. This is the real filo, guys. 
So you see this wooden thing, it's very special and long. Alex, so we, we put some flour on the edges so it doesn't stick to the stick, the wooden stick, and then we roll it open and close, open and close. As you see, some flour doesn't get, get stuck. It will be a homemade pita. The filling she already did. So we open as much as thin as we can. So now we put butter mixed with oil on the dough. Ah. She says, well, do it with your fingers. It's even better than a brush. So we do all over the surface. And now, and now we, so we cut like a moon, full moon, and then on slices. Φιλαράκια. Σαν μαργαρίτα είναι. Ναι. It's like a flower, margarite. Ναι. Τώρα αυτό το ανοίγουμε έτσι για να ανοίξει καλά μετά το φύλλο. Just follow the process, guys. She's open it like this. Το βάζουμε αυτό έτσι. Okay, that's the way. Όλο μαζί. Ωραία. So this is that. So now we close it. Okay. Well. Uh -huh. So we leave it rest. This is the one part. The part. And now is the other filo she will prepare. Okay, so the process is exactly the same. Will be uh, boring to film all everything. I will show you a little bit around how a Greek home looks like. So we have Pavlos here and doesn't have internet. There's the family pictures, more family pictures of my daughter and my son. These are the girls from my sisters. And don't believe it or not, this is me with my father. Exactly. And my boy and girl, a beautiful art with light at night, Egyptian art, the most important in the kitchen, you have the television and the canapé, because you lay down after the food, you siesta, most important part is, look at this, in the kitchen having my mother her private church, or icons to protect us family and at the moment maybe the nation okay let me show you from the balcony in the old days when i was living here from here on you could see the sea exactly now you see a building more building this is the balcony more buildings so here in front you could see the sea in the harbor of the saloniki only a little bit less green. It's the garden of my parents. This is the garden of my parents. Pavlos, and this is my father, Yorgos. Yorgos Kiryakidis. 
<laughs> so is there any, resem <laughs> is there any resemblance to my <laughs> let's see okay this is the process how we open it the second time now it's more easy because it's the butter and the oil is <laughs> working we open the size we need for our baking plate I will show you the baking plate. She put already butter and oil. She has a mixture of oil and butter. So that's the baking plate. So you see the technique how you roll it. I will focus more on the rolling. So you open it. Now we are ready. Mm -hmm. So now we are rolling it. We take the baking plate and then this is the way we do it, guys. Είναι βούτυρο εδώ και δεν κολλάει. Ήθελε πιο πολύ βούτυρο. Όχι, εδώ σε μάκρυ δεν μπήκε το βούτυρο. Mm. On the corners, she has not enough butter, she says. And doesn't really stick the Α, dough to the plate. Εντάξει. Πότε έμαθες να κάνεις πίτα? Από μικρή. Πόσο μικρή δηλαδή. Τα τρία με τα τέσσερα. She does this when she learned when she was 13 years old, making pitas and cooking. Και τώρα είσαι? Τώρα έχω με λίγο λαδάκι εδώ πάνω. Όχι, πόσο χρονών είσαι? Τώρα πόσο είμαι, 81. 81. Now she's 81. So make the counting. She started when she was 13. So now we put some mixture again, oily butter. Now is the filling. The gemisi. The gemisi. is the filling. You will see it. It's the fried leek and mashed meat, paprika, salt and pepper, and the four eggs. Bread. And my recipe, but I made the same kind of pie, but then with uh, puff pastry in the Netherlands. So, says we have to. Equals breading, she says. It's very important. So it's baked all over at the same time. Tora ine, and that's very merry tora tal to filo nagini. Yes, to psisimu that to vasge, exero to furnus us. Posu psinio furnus. A got of vasos to caton benida caton of donda, a la to vasos to cigano. Για να ψήσει σιγά σιγά να μην καεί. Το βάζω πάνω κάτω. Και πόση ώρα? Ανάλογα σύμπα του φούρνου. Ναι. Εγώ το βάζω 45-50 λεπτά. Okay. Αλλά είναι φόρμος που ψένει. Πού το βαλατάλλω. Εδώ είναι. Είναι φούρνος που ψένει γρήγορα. Είναι φούρνος που ψένει σιγά. Οκ. Mm. Okay. 
So now is the other part. If you saw already how she does the the filler opening, she will put it yes, above. Also, also yeah, it's really soft. You can feel it. Really, really mm -hmm. nice. And when everything is ready, goes in the oven 45 to 50 minutes at around 180 degrees. And it, of course, it depends your oven if it's hot air or whatever. I always say after 40, 45 minutes, keep an eye on it. The same recipe I have, but it's in Dutch on my channel. And I did it with puff pastry, just bought from the supermarket. It's a completely different story than this homemade from Mama Angela. The top of our pie, exactly the same. We roll it on our, you need to have the stick, plastisis in Greek. Otherwise, improvise. It's a kind of may a meter of wood, maybe from a broom or something. If you want to improvise, here you can just buy them. I, my father just gave me one, new one. This one she has for, I think, over 30, 40 years. <laughs> So we put oil all around, it gets nice baked. We're closing the the pie, mm -hmm. some oil on the top, and then we, you see what she does. It's closing like this. So all, everything stays inside. Almost done. Bravo. Poor Leo there. So as you see, Real Greek stuff. They're not afraid of putting oil or butter. I, I was more conservative. <laughs> oh, now we're cutting otherwise. So this is important also. Kind of ceremony. Now we cut. Otherwise, she says it will rise in the center too high and it will break. That's why she makes the cuttings in the pastry, in the filo, homemade filo. Eh? You get the point. This will be a long film, but I think maybe interesting. So you see from a real Greek family, a real Greek mama, how she does it. Very inspiring also for me because when I was young living here, I was not allowed to learn how to cook it because it's something for the women, said my mother then. Now she changed her mind because she knows I'm a good cook. Daxi. Daxi. Para so, this is my mother, Kiri Angela. Okay, she's also very thankful. And just us. Okay, so we have a we preheat the oven 180 degrees. Okay, guys, so I'll see you after 45 to 50 minutes. So, after 50 minutes, pie is ready. Left it resting. There it is. Oh, there.
Ωραία. Εντάξει. Ευχαριστώ πάρα πολύ. Παρακαλώ λίγο. Παρακαλώ λίγο. Ας έτσι μαμάδα. Thank you very much. Σε σε έτσι μη βελκόμα λίγο πίσω.